crash and burn. Today, I am going to be discussing uh, the Venetian Snares traditional synthesizer music. This was released a few years back on Planet Mew. And I think it was, well, wait, hang on, I have it here. It was released uh, 2016 via Planet Mew on uh, Aaron Funk's label, Time Sig. I have to say that I know a lot of people really dug this record. They liked how it was completely done on a modular synthesizer and how each song was built, like, custom from the ground up, only to be completely disassembled by the end and therefore completely rendered completely incapable of being replicated which I guess is clever and everything. But the only song I really loved was Dreamt Person version three, which is coincidentally the first track. I mean, the rest of the record, it has its moments, but I don't know, I just didn't love this one. I thought it was good and I thought it was clever and he has continued to raise the bar with every release that he puts out. And this, this record is certainly no exception, but I just found that, I don't know, it just didn't click, I guess. And it's not quite as frenetic as his other releases. It's it's not as crazy. It's it's It has more a, a greater sense of control. And maybe that's what I miss. I miss the, like, Higgins, low, groove, track, funk hits craziness, I guess. Assuming I even got that title right. Or the cavalcade of glee and daddiest happy hardcore pom-poms. Fuck, I'm telling you, his record titles are like episodes of Rockford. I really, I can appreciate what this record brings to the table. And like I said, I did love the first song, but the rest of it, I just felt it just kind of fell by the wayside and I just, it just didn't connect. So I, I don't want to keep going on and on about it if, if I don't love it. So I think I'll cut it there. This has just been a short discussion about the Venetian Snares is, uh, traditional synthesizer music that he released a few years back via TimeSig slash Planet Mew. And yeah, I'm going to go. So thank you so much for checking this out, even though I suppose this was kind of pointless. Don't forget to like and subscribe anyways, because it really helps me out. And I really, really appreciate that. And yeah, so I will see you guys next time. Thanks again. I just wanted to say thank you for making it through the entire video. I really appreciate it. And I'm going to remind everyone one more time, even though I've probably already done this in the video that you just watched, to please click the like button as well as the subscribe button because it helps this channel grow. And thank you for hitting like and subscribe. And we will see you guys really soon.